put the bra back on the hanger. But why? I really like this one. Because it won't fit you. So, do you have the right sizes for this movie? No, we only have normal sizes. Normal? So I'm not normal? No, 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 no. She didn't mean that. Of course, you are normal, miss. Our Vita Romano brand has many options that will fit you perfectly. Yes, we are just out of sizes for this model, but these are floor models. I'll bring you the right model from the back, okay? Okay, let's try. Courtney, can I talk to you for a second? Okay. She didn't mean that. Are you out of your mind? That could have gone in the wrong direction, so I decided to help. Help? Okay, now listen up. You work in the luxury boutique that serves the cream of society, slander cream of society, but people like her jeopardize Vita Romana's image. You are just an intern. You have no idea how things work here. Got it? Oh, sorry, okay. Okay. Although, mm -hmm. Since you are so eager to help that hippopotamus, here it is, that perfect bra for her. It... Isn't it broken? Broken? So what? But we cannot sell the broken bra. I told you that we will sell it. You made the mess, clean it up. But I won't sell a defective bra. It's not right. Honey, you are nobody here. And I've been a senior saleswoman at Peter Romano Boutique for 10 years. Understand? Not really. One word from me to the senior management and you are down here. Got it now? Got it. Good girl. Now go help the customer. Courtney has already found a suitable model for you, Liz. Oh, gosh, it's perfect. Uh, yes, it's your size, miss. Thank you. Always happy to help. Can I try it on? There is no need for that. Trust me, it'll look perfect on you. Well, I don't know. I... Can I pack it? You're right. The bra is perfect. I'll take it. Wonderful, Courtney. We'll check you out. <sighs> Courtney, come here. I need your help. See this bra? Do you know how to make it better? How? Voila, take all the models from this branch and redo the price tags to triple the price. Is this someone's order? Yep. Mine. We can earn some extra money on stupid men who come in to buy Valentine's Day gifts. <laughs> but I can do that. You can do that? Then the manager will know that you scanned the poor fat woman. I did it on your orders. <laughs> what orders? Your name is on the check, baby. So, you have two options. The first option, get fired for scamming, and no one else will hire you in the city. Or make some extra money with me. I won't take a time of this scam. As you wish. More for me. Hello. Good afternoon, sir. Excuse me, miss. Uh, can you help me choose some underwear for my wife? Of course, sir. 
I think this one is perfect. My wife will like it. The price indicates the high quality. It seems very expensive and high quality line. What do you think? Yes, this bra is good, but sir, maybe do you want another model? No, I think this one is perfect. But this model costs $300. Yes, I see. You know, I just want the most expensive model from Vito Romano for my wife. She really loves the high-end stuff. And she highlights the brand of Vito Romano. Okay. Shall we go to the checkout? Of course, sir. You know, my wife and I are going through a hard time in our marriage right now. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. So I decided to do something nice for her. I decided to give her something more exclusive, more expensive, to show her how much I care about her. I don't know if this is a good idea. What do you mean? It's a great buy, isn't it? I mean, the prices here are a little different. Different? Why? It seems to me... Um, oh, yes, yes. Uh, sorry, the actual price for this model is much lower. This is a less expensive model. I think it's been mispriced. Okay, what's about there then? No, it's also not the right price tag. I see. What about over this one here? Or this one? Look, sir, everything in this row is overpriced. Is it really someone's mistake or malicious intent? Malicious intent, but please, sir, don't tell anyone or the head saleswoman will fire me. Oh, I see. Can you show me this senior saleswoman? Karen, the customer asked for a senior saleswoman. Yes, sure. How can I help? You see, I have a big budget for the gift for my wife and I want to update all her underwears. Mm -hmm. And she knows a lot about it and I don't want to mess it up. Okay, sure. What about her measurements and your budget? 51, 39, 50 and budget $3,000. And I need a salesperson like you to find all her sets for her. Sure. Of course, sir. You may like this model and this model too. And she loved this. The icing on the cake are special transparent red bra. Mm. Very sexy. Mm -hmm. Turns out you have a lot of options for my abnormal wife. And who is it with him? And this is also Vito Romano. And the person in the photo is my wife, who you humiliated and then forced the intern to sell her a defective bra. Vito Romano? No, 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 no. You, you've got it all wrong. She's lying to you. Then why did she refuse to sell me an overpriced product? <sighs> No, I just, uh, I just wanted to help the brand make more money uh, and uh, to get through the financial crisis. Okay, I got a better idea how you can help us get the financial crisis. How? By cutting the personal costs. Exactly. She, she's... And starting with you. Don't let astray by others in this life, okay? Do what you think is right. Yes, yes, sir. I'm sorry. I'm so embarrassed about it. I, I, I'll never do anything like that. I, I promise you. I believe you. 
don't betray my trust. Senior saleswoman, Courtney. <laughs>